embryology of breast its formation during the embryonic life sources it developed from epidermis part of the ectoderm and mesenchyme ectoderm it is responsible for formation of alveoli and ducts mesenchyme it is responsible for formation of connective tissue fat and smooth muscle of nipple and areola note nipples are poorly formed and depressed in neonates neonates are children in the first 28 days of their life the breasts of male and female neonates are identical the breasts of neonates may be enlarged and may produce some secretion due to exposure of maternal hormones that pass through the placenta and enter the fetal circulation the breasts of neonates consist of lactiferous ducts and no alveoli this is the sequence of formation of breasts from memory crest to primary memory buds to secondary memory buds to lactiferous ducts and then in the end memory pits are formed step 1 formation of memory crest in fourth week memory crest develop on each side of the ventral surface of embryo they extend from armpit to inguinal region except for the part that forms the future breast the remaining crest disappear in the figure you can see the memory crest are two lines on the ventral surface of embryo that extend from axilla to inguinal region step 2 formation of primary memory buds in fifth week primary memory buds are formed from the remaining memory crest they grow downward from epidermis into the mesenchyme as you can see in the figure on the right side these changes are induced by the mesenchyme now they transform into secondary memory buds skin each primary memory bud give rise to several secondary memory buds these are the branching of the primary memory bud inside the dermis entering further into the dermis step 4 formation of lactiferous ducts secondary memory buds develop into lactiferous ducts this canalization occurs due to exposure of placental sex hormones and in fetal circulation the development continues till late fetal period and by that time 15 to 19 lactiferous ducts are formed step 5 formation of memory pits at the site of origin of breast in the late fetal life the epidermis becomes depressed and forms memory pits and as soon after birth nipples arise from the proliferation of area of areola that surrounds the memory pits that is why the nipple of neonates looks depressed and not well formed and elevated